this is on wood. I'm not an art expert, but you can see the green and texture. The frame, it's not, I don't believe it's original to the frame, and the frame itself, though, is very old. You can see it's cracked and split from time. But it is on wood, and there's more of the frame cracking. And my grandfather bought this. Uh, he was a he was an antiques dealer years and years ago, and um, he had a knack for acquiring unusual pieces. I don't know where he got it, but uh, he was able to get some things throughout that we know throughout history that were very very valuable. Uh, there was a king's bushel, a brass bushel, and some other things. Um, it, this appears to be original. I mean, it's got everything. It's got the, the lines and stuff. And it is hand-painted on wood. Uh, maybe some art experts out there can tell me, obviously, if it's not original, who did it and when, and if it, what kind of value it might have. Um, but there's some original, there's some flex missing up top on the veil. And, um... But yes, this, so he had this, he had this, he'd gotten this at least in the 70s, or if not earlier. And I, I don't, like again, I don't know where he acquired it from, um, but he did have a knack for putting his hands on things that were, people didn't know what they were worth, and uh, he had a Tiffany lamp, he had a King's Brass bushel, uh, that was the official measurement for the, for the, for grain, that was... From dating from way way back, like 15th century or something. Um, I don't claim necessarily that this is that the original. It says there's one in Washington. Maybe this Van Roger Vanderweer Vanderweer. I'm probably mispronouncing that. Um, had may have done more than one um, of it, especially since they didn't have printing presses at that time, um, and they couldn't just you know cop print it. You know just copy or all, print off another uh, version they would have had to repaint another one for if someone else wanted one so maybe this is something like that i really don't know but hopefully some art experts out there can tell me uh, you see there's some more missing pieces down there on the paint that'll stabilize on the on the fingers some missing flecks of paint and uh, it's it's been the well on the whole been try to be very careful with it the whole time and uh, and you can see the texture right there and I'll show you the overall gist of it but it is on wood I'm not going to knock on it um, well let's see if I can make a little sound here I'm not going to tap on it hard, but it, it is on wood. And I'll see if turn it around here and show you the back of it. And that's the that's the back. And there's a there's a very old Pete Tate little note on here that I assume he put on here, and you can see the tape is quite old itself. Uh, but it says portrait of a lady, oil on panel, circa 1455, Roger Vander Weyden. Uh, Flemish 1399-1464 um, Like I said, I don't claim this is original, but I, I would like to know more about it if any art experts out there know And there is like a little paper on the back where it's You know where it was it was mounted or something This sorry for the lighting. It's kind of poor in here but Like I said if he had that he's had this at least he died, you know when I was young uh, about 1990 or so, and I was 10. Um, and so, but yeah, he's had he had this at least since the 70s. I know, and it was probably old then. And it looks original. I mean, whoever made it, I mean, is very talented in their copying or or what whatever. But so that's that's the thing. It is on wood. The frame it's cracked from age. Um, it's, it's, you've got little splits here over time, and you've got paint, I'm not going to touch it, but it's, it's raised, it's textured paint, it's not flat, 
and it does have cracking what appears to be from age you can't probably can't see it here close up but let's see I'll try to try to show it here too once more if it can get up close my camera's not that great it won't focus but But it 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 looks it looks original. I don't know if they made it, he made multiple copies or what, but that's that's the gist of it. And if there are any if there are any experts out there who know could tell me more about it, I'd be very very grateful. I appreciate it. Um, but yeah, that's so. I was just curious, and that's I've had this in my possession, like I said, for years, and I just like to know more about it and if it's original or if it's a copy or. And if it is a copy, who made it and when, and is it worth much or if anything. Thanks, and bye.